surprised would be the right word. Um, I just got there. Well. What do you expect to see tonight that you haven't seen? I would. I don't know why I would ever entertain that thought. <laughs> I just prepare. So, I'm focused on myself right now. I'm not trying to. Why would I out there I'm so thankful I'm like listening to gospel music I'm just praying I'm, I'm just so happy I haven't put a singlet on and competed in a full tournament since November so and I think that was good for me because normally I compete a lot in all the years leading up to like tournaments two tournaments every month stuff like that and I think I gave my body a break and my mind a break and that presented challenges training because I'm normally kind of used to having this outlet <laughs> And so then I was like, wait, why am I so angry? Oh, I have to deal with things that I can't go put on the thing with complete. So right now I'm just I'm loving this. I'm really grateful. Well, how'd, you, how'd you feel, you know, you made the weight cut the first tournament since I think how'd you feel as far as that goes? I don't feel any different. I think so many people kind of told me like, hey, we can do green or something, we can do that, and maybe I start to believe it at some point and I really consider changing it. But my team, like my team they're like, no way, you're going to do this to watch, it's going to be easy. I mean, I didn't have to cut with the morning boyans just to hang out. I mean, God is so good. I'm like, I never thought I was going to see this weight. In fact, the last time I made it at World Cup, I swore I was never going to make this weight again. And that was like 2009. Last night, Periscope made a point of crediting Valentine for believing in her when others may have questioned her. Is, do you find the same thing from him? Oh, what do you mean? Just the fact that, for example, when Periscope went out to the world, so everybody was questioning yeah. what he believed in. Yeah. Do you get yeah. the same belief from him that maybe you don't get from others? Yeah, I mean, Valentin, when I was having trouble making the decision, he's like, what, what's your problem? Like, you have two choices. Most people don't have a choice. Like, you can choose to go at any big class that I believe you'll do it at both. And so I was like, oh, that is the point. But sometimes it's better to not, you know, to have no choice because it makes it easier. Valentine's always believed in me. He was like, hey, if you go 58, you know, we're not changing our training. If you go 58, well, we're not changing our training. So. You talked a little bit about taking a break. How important is it to balance, you know, your training and then taking breaks at the same time? It's 